Yo, yo, what up, Bills Mafia? Z-Bot here with you from the Fanatics, and today we are unboxing the new Josh Allen action figures from Import Dragons. Super stoked about these. Let's jump right into it. Thinking back on it when I was a kid, there were literally no Bills figures. I remember the first time they came out with one. It was Drew Bledsoe. I can distinctly remember my mom going to Target and picking it up. It was like this big. It was like an inch tall. But we all know Josh Allen is that dude and he's getting everything. He's got Funko Pops. You name it, it's happening with Josh Allen. And now we got the action figure, which I think is awesome. So we're going to unbox it. As you can see, it comes with uh, two different variants. There's a Chase variant and a normal variant. Pretty bogus. Don't, don't get both. Uh, I'm an idiot. I got both. The Chase variant, uh, the only difference between the two, the Chase has uh, white cleats and white socks. The normal variant has uh, blue socks and red cleats. That's the only difference. I mean, they had a killer opportunity here to put them in two different uniforms or whatever and drop the ball completely. Don't be an idiot, don't be me, don't buy both. You only need one. Uh, but we're gonna unbox both, because I have them, so why not? Let's start with the regular variant, the OG. Uh, so in this version of the figure, Josh Allen comes in the away uniform, uh, white top, the white jersey, blue pants, red cleats, blue socks, now, I, I'm a huge action figure guy. Most people don't know this about me, but um, I've been collecting them since uh, I was a kid. I freaking love them. And the one thing you always got to remember when it comes to action figures, it's just like chicken wings. Chicken wings. A wing is only as good as its blue cheese. An action figure is only as good as its box. And you're probably thinking, like, what the hell are you talking about? To me, it's all about the box. When I get these figures, I almost never take them out. I'm actually like dying inside right now that we're opening these because I usually leave them in the box. And when you display them, typically you leave them in the box and that's what you see all the time. So right off the bat, I look at the box of this one. It's better than I thought it was going to be, honestly. When I saw it on uh, the image when I bought it, um, it kind of looked a little bland, but looking at it now, I think they did a killer job. Uh, so on the side, you see it says Josh Allen, Bill's Helmet, Series 1. Then on the back, which I think is the coolest part of the box, it's got Allen's jersey. And then on the side, you got the Bills logo. Um, and then here's the figure right in the front. All right, let's dive into it. Let's open this baby up and check out what it looks like on the inside. So we will dive into it. Like I said, man, I am so stoked that the Bills are getting love like this. I think Allen's going to be on the cover of Madden, if not this coming year than soon, but like just to see all the stuff happening with the Bills because of Josh Allen, you know, how far they've come, it's awesome. And now we got a freaking action figure. I'm all about it. Now I keep saying action figure, right? This technically isn't an action figure. And if you see on the back of the box, it says, this is not a toy, 14 plus. Now, you know, look, if you're under 14, you don't need to be 14 plus to buy this thing. It's not gonna bite yet, but it's not an action figure. There's no articulation. Now, that's a nerd word for there's no movement. When action figures articulate, that means they have like the little creases within them that you can move them around and pose them and whatnot. This is essentially just a statue. So, not technically an action figure, but I'm calling it an action figure because uh, this is going to get some action on my mantle, I'll tell you that. All right, so take it out of the box. Boom. There he is. My boy, J-A-Q-B-1, number 17. Of course, this doesn't want to come out. If I break this on camera, I swear to God. Really? This sucker is in there. Come on. It's like Josh Allen in, in person, man. You, you can't tackle him. You can't, you can't get him down. There's a string holding him down. There's a string on the back of this. He's tied in there. Jesus, come on, bot. We'll move this to the side. This is the little uh, playing field piece that it comes with. And as you can see, it's got a little hole in there. That's where Josh Allen's cleat will go. 
So if you're putting them on display outside of the box, which I guess I'm going to do now because this thing is freaking wired in there, uh, that is how you do it. So I'll take the tape off of this and then we'll set this to the side. All right, now that uh, this genius over here has figured out that it's wired in, let's unwire JA here. Tell you what, this is not this is not dummy proof. Watch me slice my freaking hand off here. Come on, I think that worked? I cut it. Boom, baby! I I got it. Good lord! All right. Okay, that was absolutely ridiculous. Boom! There he is, folks. JA17. He's in that running stance, if you can tell. Obviously. The way they built him up here, he is on the move as he usually is. Checking out the details here, they really nailed the football, which is awesome. It's got all the little details that every NFL football has. He's got his uh, play sheet on his arm here, NFL towel. Uh, like I said, blue pants, they nailed that. Looks great. Back of the jersey, Allen. And the helmet looks really good too. Got the captain logo right there. J.A. is getting ready to take this ball to the house. All right, let's take the little panel here, uh, the field, and we'll, uh, so it's got this little peg sticking out of the right cleat, and you put that into the hole, and then it'll hold him. Here he is in the panel. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. Very accurate in the sense of the build, the body, it really nails. You look at this, you, obviously it's, you're not thinking twice, it's Josh Allen. Obviously if you lean in towards his face, kind of looks like Nick Jonas a little bit, if I'm being 100% honest. So I don't know why that came to mind, but the more I look at it, uh, Nick Jonas might be taking the snaps for the Bills in 22. Now on the inside of the box, it's got this, uh, this placard that slides out easily. I think that's pretty cool. Got the Bills logo in the background. That slides out easily. So if you wanted to, you know, display them outside of the box, you could kind of have it like this. And that would look cool if you wanted like a backdrop for the figure or whatever. That's kind of sweet. All right, that's the OG version. I'm gonna set them to the side. Let's check out the Chase version. Like I said, pretty weak. The only difference between the two is that this one, the Chase variant has the uh, white cleats with the white socks. I prefer that though. To me, the white cleats, cleanest in the game. Let's dive into it. Hopefully I learned my lesson from the last time. Also trying to not wind up in the emergency room. Did I get it? Got it. That boy's free. Now right, let's take out the Chase variant. And same deal as the uh, as the regular. All right, let's take a look at them both side to side here. They're sweet, man. Boy, why would you not want Josh Allen on your nightstand while you're sleeping? Is that weird? Totally digging these. Excited to have them in the collection, and uh, it's gonna look sweet with the rest of my absurd amount of bill stuff that I own. I'm sure all you guys do too. So if you're looking to snag one, I'll have the link below anywhere you're watching this, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, wherever, link will be somewhere that you can find it and put one of these bad boys up into your Bills collection. So cool stuff. All right, that's a wrap. Josh Allen, JA17, QB1, the man that looks good in shorts, forever immortalized into an action figure. Now I'm just waiting on the Josh Allen in shorts variant to drop. And when it does, unboxing video coming your way, Bills Mafia. But until then, thanks for checking this one out. And as always, go Bills. Allen takes the snap, surveys the field. He's got nothing. He scrambles out of the pocket. He's going to take it himself. Allen's got a seam. Oh, he jukes to the left. Boom to the right. spin -arama. Oh, he hurdles over a guy twice his size. Juke, nope, you can't stop him. He's down the sideline, whoop! Chris Berman whoop as he literally does a Simone Biles type swirl into the, into the air. Now he's taunting the other team as he's literally running backwards into the end zone, backflip, boom! Touchdown, Allen. 
as he crosses the pylon.